All right, what's up, Hot Squad, and happy Friday to y'all. So, yes, it's now time for more trade reactions for this week. On a Friday, of course, um, I never got a chance to do it on a Friday, but I'm doing it this Friday because I got no reactions coming Saturday, and also I have big announcements coming right after this reaction. I have to, have to get to y'all. So, Hot Squad, yes, yesterday Paramount has just released a new official trailer. It's so one of the most anticipated movies of the year, Transformers Rise of the Beast. So, I'm excited for it. You know, I enjoy watching the Transformers movies. The first Transformers will always, always be one of my favorite movies of all time. I used to watch it all the time, mostly every single month when it first came out back in 2007. Like, I just freaking loved it, man. It was so freaking awesome seeing it, seeing the Long Box and Septicons live, live action. It was like Michael Bay did a huge one for that one. Uh, Revenge of the Fallen, I liked that first, but come think of now, it sucks. It actually sucks, honestly. So, Dark and the Moon, I enjoyed that. It's not, it's not as great as the first one, but it's right at that level. I actually did really like Dark and the Moon. Age of Extinction and The Last Night with Marky Mark. Well, y'all yeah, know that is straight up garbage. Yes! <laughs> straight up freaking garbage. And it's just like, okay, Michael Bay, y'all, you need to stop. You need to stop with these movies, seriously. Yo, tell me with this. Then, then comes the prequel, Bumblebee. With um, Haley Seinfeld playing this character, uh, the main character, well, the, the human character, I think Charlie was the name, um, Bumblebee. That was actually was pretty good. It had John Cena in it too as well, I remember. It was actually pretty damn good. And I really enjoyed that. It's, it's, um, I'd say it's my, it's my second favorite Transformers movies um, of actual watch. So yeah, I, I'm definitely excited to see what Rise of the Beast is going to be about. I know it's going to be based on Beast Wars. I never grew up with Beast Wars, so all you Beast Wars fanics, you know, comment and let me know about if Beast Wars is worth watching. I might check it out. So, Hot Squad, what for ado? It's time to check out the new official trailer of Transformers Rise of the Beast. And now, Hot Squad, it's time to roll out. Let's check this out. And now, our feature presentation. Hmm. RP DMX. For centuries. Our kind has stayed hidden on Earth. But darkness has found us again. Oh, since Like a period beast. This is about the fate of all living things. Unicron is coming. Wow. Oh my god. That's not nice. oh, okay. Yeah. That's a big one. Oh, I thought we were boys. <laughs> you want it? Come and get it. <laughs> you brought a human here. Uh oh. I'm nobody. I ain't even seen nothing. I'm not even seeing anything right now. Thank you, hold the for you have a the aim. Damn. This is not our war. Optimus, we must trust each other to protect the home we all share. What's up, yo? What's up? How big can this guy be? Uh, he eats planets. So, like, way bigger than a planet. <laughs> I know that's Pete Davidson voice. There you go. Nice. In the end, everything you cared for oh, man. will be consumed. Maybe there's another way to save our home. You've never faced anything like this. Let them come. Hmm. Oh boy. <laughs> hey. Nice one stop. Oh yeah, that's a nice one stop. Oh wow. Nice. Right. Yo, Noah, take the wheel. Oh, wait, what the hell? He's got exosuit, June knife. He got exosuit, Anthony Ramos character. What? <laughs> Damn. He wants to get in the action too? Oh, wow. That was actually a pretty good trailer. I actually enjoyed that. I did quite enjoy that. Oh, wow. So, but yeah, oh, wow. <laughs> 
Quite the cast. I'm here. I heard like the voices. Um, I know. I think Peter Dinklage voices the um the main villain of the of the movie. If I believe so, the guy who's the um the second guy said India. I think that was him, Peter Dinklage. I'm not too sure. I did some research on that, but yeah, I heard Michelle Yeoh's voice is voicing the Eagle. Um, I gotta know the names of the other auto bosses in this. So yeah, um, yeah, this looks badass. This looks pretty damn badass. And um, another thing, if you don't know who's directing this, is Stephen Cable Jr. He directed Creed 2, actually. I enjoyed Creed 2, which I'm surprised, you know, he actually directed he directed this. So, I hope it's, you know, damn good. hope it's damn good, you know. We'll make the Michael Bay movies, you know, watchable. And the action is so freaking bombastic or not. But I hope, you know, every, you know, it's going to be really damn good. June is stacked as hell as movies. My God. You mean, you got Across the Spider-Verse, The Flash, which I have my reaction coming up next after this. And, um... Indiana Jones and the Dial of Destiny. I mean, the list goes on. Summer needs to be packed. And I really freaking hope Paramount releases trailer for Mission Impossible: Dead Reckoning Part One. I mean, come on, Paramount! It's been a, it's been a year. It's been a year since we had the last trailer. Like, come on, Paramount! Where is it? Where is at? Damn it! So yeah. So overall, the trailer is actually really good. It looks pretty damn awesome. I'm definitely checking this out. Oh yeah. So Hot Squad, there you have it. That was my new trailer reaction for Transformers: Rise of the Beast. Looks like it's the absolute must watch. Hopefully it is. You know what I'm saying? So it's nice to see, you know, have Transformers back once again in the big screen. Two months comes out already. Oh boy, man, already two two uh, months until June. That's crazy, y'all. So it's so gonna be jam packed of um movies, which I will do course course to be doing my YouTube short reviews on it every time. And also, like I said, after this reaction, big announcements for people, um, who don't know who are now subscribed to my channel? I will be posting community posts mostly every single Monday or so. I will post reactions. I mean, I will post in like you know announcements of, of what I'm going to react to, like each week and which one I'm not going to do. And for review embargoes and my thoughts on anything was happening in the world and other stuff. So if you've seen my community post, you already know. But if you don't have seen it, there you go. So I will be posting every single mostly one two days each week. Of all the announcements coming out for um my channel, so please be watching on that. And also another thing, next week, you no, know, starting next Wednesday, I will have my last week, last last day reactions for the month of May. So because I have my vacation, I got my graduation, I have my birthday coming up, so I will be damn sure busy at the time next week, next Wednesday, I believe. Yeah, next Wednesday. So I want to do reactions at the time. I will be off for like a one and a half. Weeks and I will be doing reactions right there. I'm done with mostly everything, my vacation, all that. So, not a big announcement after that. So, yeah, overall, this this movie looks like it could be pretty damn good. It could be one of the best. Who knows? It might be the best since the first one. So, there you go. So, Husky, if you enjoyed my reaction, Transform Brothers to Beast, please hit that button. Comment, share, share thoughts. What's your favorite Transformers movie? What's your least favorite? And what's your favorite Autobot, Sepcons, and human characters, all that. So, Hot Squad, please sit back, relax, because I have my reaction for The Flash. The second trailer just dropped this week, earlier this week, I believe. So, I missed out on the first one doing reaction to that. So, I'm doing the second one just to make up for it. I have a lot of reactions to get through. Trust me. I'm trying to get to it through as I can. So, please bear with me, y'all. So, Hot Squad, please stay tuned for my Flash trailer reaction. In a few moments, I will see y'all on the other side.